I imagine a city where cars no longer crawl on congested roads but soar in the open sky. Picture a world where the humdrum of daily traffic is replaced by the quiet whir of electric propulsion, where the skyline is not just a sight to behold, but a path to traverse. Welcome to the future, a future where flying cars are not just a figment of our sci-fi fantasies, but a reality. For decades, the concept of flying cars has been a staple of pop culture, a symbol of a future that is always tantalizingly out of reach. But today, we are on the brink of turning this dream into a reality. Companies around the globe, from startups to tech behemoths, are investing billions to bring flying cars to our skies. They are designing vehicles that are part car, part drone, and entirely revolutionary. These machines, powered by electric propulsion systems, promise to take us to our destinations faster and in a more eco-friendly manner. But of course, the journey to this future is not without its challenges. There are technical hurdles to overcome, infrastructural changes to be made, and regulatory frameworks to be established. Yet the progress we have seen so far gives us reason to be optimistic. Now let's take a moment to consider what this future might look like. Imagine waking up in a city where the buzz of drones fills the air. You step out onto your balcony not to enjoy the view, but to hop into your flying car. As you ascend, the cityscape unravels beneath you. The skyscrapers, parks, and rivers become a part of your daily commute. The city, once a concrete jungle, transforms into a living, breathing organism, its arteries cleared of congestion, its air purer, its people happier. One can only wonder what would life be like in this aerial utopia? Welcome to the city of tomorrow. A harmonious blend of green spaces, sleek architecture, and bustling life. Picture this. A vibrant metropolis where flying cars are not a fantasy but an integrated part of everyday life. These vehicles soaring through the sky reduce congestion on the streets below, making way for pedestrian-friendly zones and lush city parks. But it's not just about aesthetics. The environmental impact is profound. With electric propulsion, these flying cars produce zero emissions, significantly cutting down on air pollution. The benefits extend beyond the environment too. Imagine sipping your morning coffee as you glide over the cityscape getting to work in a fraction of the time it used to take on gridlocked roads. Access to remote areas becomes a breeze, and the city's scenic beauty can be appreciated from breathtaking aerial perspectives. This is a city where the sky is not the limit, but the way forward. Behind this sky-high revolution lies a symphony of sophisticated technology. Imagine the hum of electric propulsion engines taking us back to the quiet serenity of the cities. These engines, coupled with batteries that pack a punch, are the heartbeat of our future flying cars. But the magic doesn't stop there. Automated piloting systems, powered by cutting-edge artificial intelligence, ensure safe and efficient journeys. Picture this, a sky filled with cars, yet no traffic jams, no honking horns, just swift, seamless movement. Now, let's touch on infrastructure. The future cityscape is dotted with vertiports, serving as both refueling stations and departure points. Buildings aren't just tall anymore, they're functional, with landing pads for your personal flying vehicle. But this isn't an easy ride. The transition from ground to sky brings its own set of challenges. Noise pollution, for one, needs to be addressed. Imagine a quiet afternoon punctuated by the constant hum of flying cars. Not so serene, is it? Safety regulations too need an upgrade from seat belts and airbags to parachute systems and collision avoidance technology. Then comes the monumental task of airspace coordination. With the sky becoming a bustling highway, managing traffic becomes a three-dimensional problem. But don't worry, advanced traffic management systems are already in the works. With great innovation comes great challenges, but as always, the human spirit is ready to rise to the occasion. Flying cars don't just change the way we travel, they change the way we live. Imagine waking up to the serene hum of electric propulsion as your flying car arrives for your morning commute. No more traffic jams, no more road rage, just a peaceful journey above the cityscape. And when you arrive at work, instead of parking in a drab, concrete structure, you step out onto a rooftop landing pad high above the city with a view that's nothing short of breathtaking. It's not just the commute that's transformed, it's the whole workday experience. Your lunch breaks? They could be at sky-high restaurants offering panoramic views of the city, 
and those long, tedious drives for out-of-town meetings, replaced with swift, scenic flights that get you there in a fraction of the time. The impact on real estate is profound. Rooftops once overlooked spaces become prime locations. Buildings evolve into vertical communities with landing pads, green spaces, and amenities all stacked up in the sky. It's a whole new way of living, with the sky literally becoming the limit. And what about the urban sprawl, that ever-expanding ring of suburbs? With flying cars, the need for such spread might decrease. Remote areas become more accessible, reducing the pressure on city centers and possibly leading to a more sustainable urban landscape. But it's not all rosy. This skyward shift brings its own challenges. Accessibility for all becomes a key issue. Will everyone be able to afford this elevated lifestyle? And what about job opportunities? While some jobs might become obsolete, others will emerge. Pilots, air traffic controllers, engineers, the list goes on. There's also the question of social equality. Could this lead to a new kind of divide between those who live and work in the clouds and those who remain grounded? It's a complex issue that needs careful consideration. In this skyward future, life is not just lived on the ground but amongst the clouds. While this future seems tantalizingly close, there are still miles to travel. Picturing a world where flying cars dart through the sky, we must also acknowledge the hurdles that lie ahead. It's not just about mastering the technology, it's about reshaping our cities, our laws, and our mindset. The first challenge is regulatory. Imagine the complexity of coordinating thousands of vehicles in the sky all while ensuring passenger safety and privacy. We are talking about a radical reshaping of air traffic control systems and stringent safety regulations. Next, we face the question of infrastructure. Transforming our cities to accommodate flying cars won't come cheap. We need vertiports, landing pads, and integrated air ground transportation. It's a massive undertaking requiring significant investment and urban planning. But let's not forget the human factor. Public acceptance is key. How do we address concerns around noise pollution, safety, and even the aesthetic of our new sky-high highways? Despite these challenges, progress is being made. Research and development continue at an exciting pace. Companies are testing prototypes, and some have even taken to the skies for preliminary trials. While it's hard to pin down a definitive timeline, some experts suggest we could see the first operational flying cars in the next 10 to 20 years. The road ahead may be steep, but the view from the top promises to be worth it. Let's keep dreaming, keep innovating, and most importantly, keep the conversation going. So we've journeyed through a city where cars take to the sky and life is lived amongst the clouds. We've painted a picture of a bustling metropolis where verdant spaces and sleek architecture coexist with flying cars, reducing congestion and offering breathtaking aerial views. Delving into the technology behind these vehicles, we've explored electric propulsion, automated piloting and advanced traffic management systems. We've imagined a new way of life with sky-high dining and rooftop landing pads, and we've discussed the social and economic implications of this shift. But we've also acknowledged the hurdles. Regulatory challenges, infrastructure costs, and public acceptance all play a role in this race towards the sky. Yet the research and development continue, pushing us closer to this aerial utopia. As we continue to reach for the skies, we invite you to join the conversation and imagine your own flying future.